Also tonight, Dayton Mayor Nan Whaley reacting to this latest tragedy to rock her city. She says she is confident the community will support Detective Del Rio and his family. Tunis reporter Adam Reif is live in Dayton with how the faces of our city are leading through this latest hardship. Mayor Whaley was at Grandview Medical Center today and spoke with Detective Del Rio's wife and family. She wants the Dayton community to step up again and support each other through another difficult episode. She's an incredibly strong woman. Dayton Mayor Nan Whaley spending time connecting with the family of wounded detective George Del Rio. This is what I know about Dayton police and Dayton police officers families. They're stronger. Uh, than most families, frankly. Mayor Whaley says the larger police family is also rallying around the Del Rios. I know the officers uh, that know him um, are, you know, in addition to doing anything they can for the family, are sharing stories that they have. I mean, he was um, an honorable, good, amazing, heroic man, and he is. Talking Tuesday afternoon, city officials struggle to cope with another blow to the community's psyche. We are experiencing yet another tragedy in a year of unprecedented tragedy. City manager Shelly Dickstein says law enforcement has been forced to shoulder an enormous emotional burden this year from the tornadoes, hate rally, mass shooting, and now a brother in blue shot in the line of duty. While I am confident in their commitment and professionalism to get the job done, I remain concerned at the toll this year has taken. Now the mayor is calling for support from within, saying Dayton and the Miami Valley have healed before and can again. I continue to be um, amazed uh, and uh, uh, filled with gratitude from the citizens of Dayton. Mayor Whaley says the city as a whole has stressed that being strong means getting help and resources during times of difficulty. She credits Police Chief Beal with helping the city be open and honest about the trauma of the past year and stressing the importance of coping in a positive way. Live in Dayton, Adam Rife, 2 News, working for you.